The IEA's International Ministerial Conference on Nuclear Power in the 21st century kicks off on October 30 in Abu Dhabi. The conference is going to provide a platform for decision makers and policy makers to come together and discuss some of the challenges that might be holding uh, the greater implementation of nuclear power back in the world. 30 countries operate about 450 nuclear power reactors worldwide. Another 57 reactors are under construction and are expected to begin operations in the coming years. Many countries expect nuclear power to play an increasingly important role in improving nuclear energy security and mitigating climate change. The IAEA is starting a new project with Cuba to combat the Zika virus using a nuclear technique. This is the first time the island will test the sterile insect technique to reduce the number of mosquitoes capable of carrying the virus. Hemos elegido esta técnica porque en comparación con las técnicas convencionales le vemos, le vemos ciertas eh, ventajas. Por ejemplo, no, no deja residuos como la fumigación. Es un método que sirve para controlar y no se elimina totalmente la plaga. Es decir, que se mantiene un cierto equilibrio. No es dañina al medio ambiente. The sterile insect technique is a type of insect bird control which uses radiation to sterilize male mosquitoes and reduce the insect's numbers. So we consider this as one additional new tool that could uh, be uh, used to integrate with the conventional methods in order to uh, try to um, reduce these uh, mosquito populations and in such a way try to reduce the transmission of Zika. Cuba plans to start trial releases in Havana at the beginning of 2018. This week, Austria celebrates its National Day. Did you know that Austria provided the IAEA with its current headquarters in Vienna? For the freedom in the world and for the future, for the sichere Zukunft von euch Jungen sein. In diesem Geiste übergebe ich den internationalen Organisationen dieses große Haus. If you would like to know more about the IAEA, please visit our website. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you next time.